Well, hello friends, Mr. Mark here from Mr. Mark's Creations. I uh, thought I'd share a little information with you regarding this 1937 Coca-Cola truck. It was the year 2010 and uh, I was in Walcott, Iowa. Actually, I was running this truck right here. And uh, actually, it had a breakdown. This was when Caterpillar was having their issues with uh, this um, regen situation. And I had to camp out for the weekend. Uh, so I had a, uh, a vehicle to drive around and I went to Walcott, Iowa, which is home to the largest truck stop in the world, which also has a museum. And part of that museum is their uh, storage yard where they uh, apparently, obviously, they locate these trucks, park them there for whatever period of time and restore the trucks, take parts off them, whatever they do. I don't know. I didn't ask. But I did get permission to uh, go behind the gates and photograph. And I have many photographs. If you're interested, I'll show you. It's not just this Coca-Cola truck. There's, there's many interesting uh, tracks. Well, I was there for the weekend. I got permission, like I said, to uh, go inside the yard at will and photograph some of their unique finds. And the 1937 Coca-Cola truck just happened to be one of them. That site I had visited several times, so I have pictures of this Coca-Cola truck in different seasons. Uh, in the winter, when it's wet, when it's dry, and uh, I, I really enjoyed it. By the way, this uh, print, this photograph, was photographed on 35 millimeter film. For those of you who even care, <laughs> there you have it. So, uh, if I see that you would like to hear more about this truck by the shares and the likes and possibly someone even ask, I would gladly share more photos and information with you. So, thanks for tuning in. That's it for now regarding the 1937 Coca-Cola truck. Friends, I really do appreciate all your interaction, your comments, uh, and your interest in trucks. They are uh, a big part of our lives, aren't they?